Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Ratchet and Clank 2 Cohen Commando. My name is Hal and wow, that blue light is so pretty. It just, it just go, oh it stops, oh but it doesn't, I just, uh, anyway, um, so today we are leaving Andeco, um, for now we'll, be, we'll pop back later. Um, I might, um, there's something we need to pick up, but we can't do it just yet. Um, and besides, we might want to upgrade our weapons a little bit later on. Uh, but for now, we are going to a new planet. Vukova Canyon in Barlow. Uh, doo -doo -doo. I don't like the way that it doesn't tell you how many platinum bolts there are on an individual level anymore. It, 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 it kind of... It makes me sad. I don't know whether or not they do it in the third game, I don't think it does either. Just a little leg up I liked in the first game. Anyway, so we are blasting off. I just love our ship. Our ship is just beautiful. It's just a beautiful little rocket. Rocket powered shippy ship. Yeah. I don't know. Anyway, um... I quite like this level actually. I like the way, I like its premise. Here we are arriving. Isn't that lovely? I like desert levels. I always like desert desert levels. Desert levels are cool. There's a cool. The level later on is awesome, but I don't want to spoil anything. But I like this. I like the fact that it's got Gadgetron in here, in this uh, level. Like Gadgetron tried to um uh what's the word? Expand into the Bogon Galaxy, but then failed. And I like that. I like that. It's a cool, it's just a little bit of backstory that gives, uh, ooh, I love this sign. Was it Tron? They could have filmed the, uh, Tron film, yeah. Tron Legacy. Ratchet and Clank style. Where Tron failed and became a desert. Anyway, let's see if there's any cool new weapons we can buy. I doubt it, severely. Ooh, ooh, the Seeker Gun! Oh, yeah, I'm getting that. The Seeker Gun is one of my favorite le levels. Try using your quick select, but my quick select isn't even full yet. Uh, we're going to carry on with a chopper for now. Oh, that was nice. Sweet, the multi-star. That's a really gay name. <laughs> it's like super gay. I love the multi-star. Well, it's purple. The light has gone from manly red to sort of slightly purpley purple. Oh, and the introduction of these blue things. I don't like the blue things. The blue things can suck my bum. Oh, the Moist Star is badass. And it does split. Splits in two. That's a nice little surprise to start off the uh, the, uh, the the video, the episode. Let's upgrade the Moist Star. Uh, but for now, we are going to use a pulse rifle because I don't want to get too close and personal with these things. Come back here. Come back here. Thank you. I just, I think, I don't like these enemies. I think... Wow, that is badass. That is so damn cool. God, anyway, <laughs> I'm a little bit taken aback by that. That made my day. Um, anyway, I uh, I don't like those enemies. They're really quite hard to kill with things like the Heavy Lancer and stuff like that. And they're just ugly. I mean, they're just basically face faces with legs and a tail. And I just thought, you know, for all the awesome design Ratchet and Clank is known for, I thought that was a bit lazy. Hello. Oh, this is not a good weapon to have right now. Let's get the Seeker Gun out. The Seeker Gun is badass. I like the way the Seeker Gun sort of makes a, a sort of... It has a successor later on in the... Uh, later on in the series. Much later on in the series, actually. In uh, the first future game, Tools of Destruction. It's, uh, I think it's called like the Raptor or something. I'm not going to use the Seeker for this. Let's use the... Oh. Well, maybe we should... No. No. Yeah, I suppose actually. Got to upgrade something. Um, yeah, I think it's called the Raptor. 
or something similar to the Seeker Gun is called the, in, um, the Raptor in... Uh, well, that's dealt with that quite easily. Um, something is... Oh, I can't remember what it's called. I think it's called the Raptor. And it works uh, essentially on the same principle, um, but instead of you shoot it and it, it sort of flies straight until it sees a target... Um, that was a waste of ammo. It, it, it locks onto the target first, which is always cool. Oh, hello. You don't seem very friendly. Meet my, uh, meet my little friends. Say hello to my little... That was terrible. That really was terrible. Didn't stand a chance. I remember having some trouble on that, but apparently that was quite easy. Oh dear. Um, right, that's quite easy. Nah, nah, no, no. Don't charge me. Oh dear. Um, oh, I've got one more left. Let's make it count. Ah! Oh, got rid of that one. You can't see me. Die, dinosaur thing. Come here. Thank you. How considerate of you for dying so quickly. Uh, right, let's use the sniper here. The only problem with the sniper is that if their weapon, if their weapon, if enemies haven't spawned, they, uh, you can't really shoot them. I like the way these guys are just having a conversation and I'm about to ruin their day. Headshot! Headshot. Um. Some steed shot, I suppose. Uh, what are you doing? You look a bit like a reptile goofy. <laughs> you walk a bit like him too. Um, right, let's get some ammo. A mini nuke ammo. Yay, that will come in handy later. Except I'm not really going to use the mini nuke in this level, I don't think. I want to focus on leveling up weapons. I, um... Oh, but I've run out of ammo of the Seeker. Um, and I've already upgraded the multi-star. Let's just use this. Oh. Oh. Let's get some nice bolts. What's in here? But, but it, yep, heavy lancer ammo. I don't want heavy lancer ammo. <sighs> what will this be, actually? Mini nuke ammo. Great. Um, right, let's do some sniping. Ooh. Don't really need to zoom, but I'm going to anyway. Ooh, now that's cool. Just look at the detail on that. Look at the detail on the ground. What the hell's going on with that? Oh, right. Okay, I thought that was glitching out then. Boom! And, uh... You two. Oh, you don't want to play. Okay, that's fine with me. Um, so the two weapons that I haven't upgraded yet have run out of ammo. Perfect. Um, let's, let's... Rah! Let's, uh... Oh, crap. <laughs> that was supposed to be a stretch jump, but it didn't work. Hello! And that's the shock, um, shock mod working at full power. Sweet. Uh-oh. Um, we've got more enemies? Nope. That's cool. Don't be a fool and oh, s step into the fire. It hurts. Ow. Okay, I nearly died then. Hey, look, it's our ship! Hi! And can we see the Tron? Where's the Tron? Where is the Tron? Oh, it's there. It hasn't spawned. See, this is what I mean. Oh, no, there it is. And invisible. And visible. And visible. Invisible. Visible. Invisible. What happens if I zoom in there? Well, what happens if I zoom in using this? Great level design there, boys. <laughs> wow. Uh... Uh, I shouldn't be slagging off my favourite game. Um, ah, yeah. I believe I'm falling in love with this game again. The only problem I've had with it is that... I feel that it's lost a little bit of the, um... The, I don't know, this didn't really matter to me when I was a kid, but now that I'm nostalgic and pretentious, it does matter to me. Or something like that. I've, I can't help but feeling it's lost a little bit of the magic in of the first game. Oh, hello. Yeah. Crap. I mean, it... The first game was very comic. Very, very comic. And very sort of uh, light-hearted and a bit wacky. And I feel like, I mean, this is still a bit wacky and it's got some good jokes in it. It really does. Ooh, Seeker Gun Ammo, that's handy. But I can't help but feel... Right, we've got a bit of an arena battle here. And they're going to come across. Gates go up. And these dickwads come across. 
I think we might use the Seeker to start off with and then just get uh, the Mini Nuke to finish off this, the Lackeys. The Lackeys, the Stragglers, that's the word I was looking for. Die! Whoa! And we got a, um... I got a Nanotech upgrade for it. Sweet. Uh, that was a bit unexpected. Um, but yeah, I just I just can't help but feel that this game it's, takes itself a little bit too seriously. I mean, it's trying to be all mature and whatnot, and it just seems a little bit like a bit of a mismatch, and that's the only problem I have with it. Apart from that, I love this game. And uh, that's partly the reason why I love the first future game so much, because of the fact that it's a... Uh, it, it managed to recapture that awesome magic the first game had so brilliantly. It's just a shame about the uh, sequels. Um, we'll get there though, we'll get there. Hello! Excuse me, I think I just blew another vacuum tube. Should I have a look? My word, you young people are so fresh these days. Oh, don't feel bad. I guess I'm just old fashioned about that sort of thing. Did you know that I've been with Gadgetron since the beginning? So you sell these gadgets? Darling, they sell themselves. <laughs> if you have a memory card PS2 containing Ratchet and Clank, save data, please insert it into the memory card already have done. Uh, any of the weapons you have earned on your Ratchet and Clank save that are offered at this vendor will be free! Sweet! So, we get a bunch of free weapons, I believe. Yep, Tesla Claw. Uh, Rhino 2 is a million. Holy crap. Uh, even though we had the Rhino, but I suppose it's because it's, you know, it's a different weapon. But yeah, we get a bunch of free weapons. We get the Bomb Glove, which even though is, uh, it's a bit silly because, you know, we've got the Gravity Bomb, which is like a better version of the Bomb Glove. But it's got more ammo, which is good. It's like a downsized version, I suppose. The Vis Bomb Gun, we all know the Vis Bomb Gun. Decoy glove I will never use. The Tesla call, which is awesome. I'm so glad this uh, weapon makes a return. And the Walloper, which I never use, but I might use in this uh, in this game, or at least try to. Yes, 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 and yes. Now let's get full ammo. Okay. And there we have it. We have a bunch of free uh, free weapons. I love that. I love that. It doesn't make quite the same um, uh, thingy. What's the word? Same sort of thing as the uh, as this. And you, you never get this sort of generosity in a video game uh, in any of these series, really. You do get perks, though. You do get perks in the next game. But I'm getting ahead of myself. So um, let's swatch swatch. Halfway between switch and swap? Yeah, let's go with that. Um, right, so I'm going to use... Uh, what am I not going to use? Um, let's just get rid of all the gadgets, except the... I'll keep the swing shot in there. Um, so, put the Tesla Claw there, because the Tesla Claw is badass. Um, and I'll put the Visibomb Gun there. I love that. I love that. The, it rewards you for playing the first... Uh, whoa, hello. First games in the series. Uh, ah! Uh, uh, hello. Let's get the Tesla Claw out. Now, in true, in, in, um, it's sort of in keeping with the, uh, the spirit of the first game, these weapons don't upgrade, which is cool. I like that. Um, and there's our ship. There's, we're back to our ship. Um, uh, but you can upgrade them post-game, like all the other weapons, and then you just automatically go to the, the, second one. It's almost, almost like buying the gold weapons, but I don't believe they are actually gold. Um, so, we get to go over here. Oh, poo. I uh, did the wrong jump. got to get used to pressing L1 instead of uh, R1 instead of R2. Um, and... Oh, crap! <laughs> that was... Uh, okay, right. Not stretch jump. Um, let's try using a high jump. Go on. Yes, there we go. Hey, buddy. Hey, who let you in here? Get lost before I flatten your robot into a hubcap. Touch him, and it's Plasma City! Oh, gosh. You didn't have to yell. <laughs> Why did he have to yell? Uh, hey, man. I can't hear you. La, 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 la. Only the little guy. Sir, it is okay. We are your fellow desert riders. You are? So you understand my 
Sensitivities? Absolutely, sir. We just came here to race. Well, you can borrow my bluebell, so long as you're gentle. She just needs a few repairs. Hang in there, my brother. Bluebell is in good hands. Wow, Ratchet really can't do smack talk. Plasma City? Oh well, okay, so, and I love this guy, I love this character, he's like a big cuddly bear. He reminds me of Rage of Ken from the Thai games, except he's blue, and he's only got, you know, two fingers. So, we've got another electrolyzer puzzle, and, um, we get so close to, uh, to doing, getting, uh, hoverbike races, and hoverbike races are awesome. Now, is it that one next? And then that one, that one, that one. There we go. We're on a roll now. Oh, close. There we go. That was easy. I need one of those uh, staple stamps. Ratchet's face is hilarious. Right, so. Um, I've got to learn these controls again quickly. Hover bike racing. Right. Oh, sweet. That was quick. Ah, ah, I don't like this. <laughs> ah, crap. <laughs> ah, damn it, I was first and now I'm 18th. Ah, damn it. Woo! Okay, so we've got to boost again, and I'm going to be... Ah, there we go. I'm not used to this. I'm going to remember how to do it. Okay, so, hoverboat racing. Hoverboat racing is awesome, I love it. This is what, um... This essentially took the same pre precipice as, uh, um, what am I looking for? Hoverboard ra- ah! Hoverboard racing and made it awesome. Made it quicker, made it more badass, made it more intense, and put friggin' dinosaurs on the track! Uh, yep. Sweet! Um, now, thanks to that rather poor beginning, I think I might have to do this a couple of times. Oh, we've, we've got three laps, we've got three laps, that's good. But I think I'm only going to show this first time and then just, you know, if I, if I don't get it the first time, I'm just going to cut to, um... Oh! <sighs> Nicely done. Get out of the way! I'm just going to cut to me winning. <laughs> um, and, to be honest, I don't know, I don't... Because, the uh, what am I trying to say? I don't know if I'm going to do the all the hover bike races, because there's quite a few, let's face it. Come on, get the boost. Ah, that was close. Because there's quite a few in each track, and it seems as I'm not going for the skill points, which I think is what you get if you get all of them. Um, I don't think I'm going to bother. So. Um, and I know you don't get any platinum bolts or nanotech upgrades at all. Right, I'm in seventh. Can I pull this out of the bag? Out of the way. Whoop. Whoop. Um... So, what am I, what am I saying? I've, I've lost my train of thought. And I've got an itchy nose. That's not something, that's not a good thing to happen when you put, <laughs> you go, God knows. Ah, oh, there we go. <laughs> that was so stupid. Yeah, I'm gonna have to do this again. Oh no, wait, no, no, maybe not, maybe not. I'm fourth, and I can see the other three ahead of me. I need a boost. Give me a boost. Thank you very much. Right. Uh, Ah, oh, holy crap! Oh yeah, yeah, I'm gonna have to do this again. Oh, oh, second. Not bad for my first attempt, since I haven't done this in ages, and I completely mucked up the beginning. Um, but, uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to do this again. Alright, ooh, I just lapped someone! <laughs> and I'm lapping another one! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! There we go. Wow, it's quite a lead as well. 2.30.09, 2 a whole five seconds faster than, uh, than my rubber thing's fallen off. That's something you don't want to hear in any other situation. Um, sweet! Great racing, buddy. Here, take this helmet so the guys know you're one of us. Thank you, sir. Uh-oh. Incoming message from the boss. Attention all Thugsville S employees. First of all, 
Whatever slug brain's been eating all the choochy bars in the break room, better quit stuffing his face. Hello? Hey, turn those lights off! It's bad feng shui. Ahem. <clears throat> Next, our space rendezvous point has been moved to, and listen up, knuckleheads, the Felsen system in sector one, two, three, four, five. If you're no good with numbers, find a buddy to help you. Lastly, the company picnic is this Sunday. And don't forget to bring your own juice this time. Hey! I saw that, Cletus! You just turned yourself a writer! Don't worry. The boss only yells because he loves us. Yes, sir. I do feel his affection. Did you see that broadcast? Not really. We should scope out that rendezvous point. Yes, we might intercept some stray transmissions. Sweet! So we got uh, some more coordinates, not for a planet this time, but for a nebula or whatever. And I only just realized, look, look, check it out, there's there's the track. That's the track down there. That's cool. I didn't realize it. You can't really see it. It's not on here. But, um, yeah, look, there's it on there. So we got a new helmet. And unfortunately, uh, where is it? It's in items. Uh, it's up here. Unfortunately, I... I don't understand why they did this. They put it like as an actual sort of an item there that you can have a look. But unlike the first game, you can't put it on and just wear it. And I was that that makes me disappointed. What's this? Electrolyzer and the hydro pack. I mean, I understand, and you can't put the hydro pack on either. It's uh, it's just it happens automatically. I understand that though. It means it's not an actual item, and you just you know take it out when you need it. But I really, really, really wish you could just put that on whenever because you know it's sad sad panda sad how um anyway before we go anywhere um uh, we need to go back into the i'm gonna go back into the first race for one reason and one reason only um no, don't worry about oh god that looked painful uh don't worry about can we break yes we can that's good um, don't worry about actually racing. So we're just going to go slowly over here and turn around here to get our platinum bolt. Sweet! So that's one of our uh, uh, do 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 one of two platinum bolts that we can get hold of uh, in this level. Um, I'm actually I've had a change of heart. I am going to do the other uh, the other challenges. There's only four four more to do. Uh, assault circuit, expert circuit. V hmm, fuck over circuit. What the hell's that? Well, I don't know, I don't really care. Um, so yeah, I will do that, but I'm going to do it in the next episode. <clears throat> um, I don't get it. Main canyon open. Main canyon open, turbo's available. Oh, it doesn't tell you what the others are. Yeah, I'm going to do that in the next episode, and because, just because, um, the other oh, come on, get the right menu out. The other area we need to explore over that way isn't that long, even though it does have a bonus in there that will take us some time. But I'm not going to spoil anything. Um, so yeah, we'll start off the next episode with that. And um, in the meantime, uh, well, that's the end for this episode. We've uh, so far we've got a helmet. We got some. Well, we upgraded. Uh, the, the uh, chopper, which is awesome, and also not to mention the fact that we got, you know, one, two, three, four, six new weapons today. Um, but yeah, that's it. Thank you guys for watching. My name is Hal, and this is probably the weirdest and awkwardest outro I've ever done. So, uh, see you next time. Cheers.